Yo, what's up guys? It's the Mobile Asian Gaming here, and sorry for not posting yesterday. Gonna be double uploading tonight, the night that I record this. Gonna be uploading so much more this week, trying to get my videos done as much as I can. About this super new, amazing content. This video, I'm gonna talk about what not to do when trying to make coins. And, I mean, I don't have too many coins. 115k is about the average amount these days. Compared to other people uh, on Instagram, I already have like 2 million coins. But this is what not to do, because in my opinion, unless you um, really have nothing to do this summer, in which case go for some of these, uh, I just wouldn't recommend doing them. So the first one is, uh, <clears throat> so I'm going to be talking about methods you might see on Instagram or YouTube, and you might think, hey, that's a good idea, but I'm going to let you know that there's a good chance you won't succeed. Of course, they have succeeded, so I guess you could potentially succeed, but it's just gonna be super hard and annoying. First things first is going to be finishing large quick sell sets. I mean, it's a good idea and concept, right? You only get two gold players. These large quick sell, pa quick sell packs could hold millions in them. Problem is, on average, you're only gonna get about four or five K out of it, and it costs right now six to seven K for these gold players. So maybe in the future, it might be worth it, but I think gold players are gonna hold their value because of this set. So any gold is gonna be worth like three K in my opinion, instead of the normal two K. So um, that is the first method you should not do. Do not just try to fill out uh, quick sell packs. Next is the infamous make a million accounts and give all your coins. So if you don't know how this works, basically what you do, uh, you go to guest, you start up a new account, you go through the tutorial, and after the tutorial, you usually end up with about 500 cash and about 20k coins. Do that like a million times, put them all in one account. I mean, and some people have got this to work, like go jacksonville.mm got like 2 million coins out of it, but here's why you shouldn't do it. It takes, on average, about 15 minutes to get through that tutorial. Around 15 minutes. I mean, if you can make it more efficient, sure, but you're gonna mess up. It's not like you're gonna get it perfect first time. I mean, look at my first video. It took me like 30 minutes. So, it's not like it's an easy thing. Uh, I know Manimal will slay uploaded a video saying this is how you should do it. In my opinion, 15 minutes per account times, like, I mean, just to get anything done, 20k uh per account and you want if you just want to make 100k that's an hour of grinding why not just snipe why not just actually grind and you might even make more than that i don't know but that's just my thoughts uh so that's the second method i would recommend not just making a million accounts and uh just getting the free rewards but there are uh, benefits to this which i might cover in a later video third things third i don't, I don't know what to say there uh, this might be the last thing because I'm drawing a blank. I have no idea what to think of. It's the thought, and I mean, I know a lot of you know this, but it's the thought that if you train your players from like a 70 to an 81, and then they become like elites, I mean, they're automatically going to be like 20 times more valuable. Of course, this is not true. As soon as you train a player, actually, I've been wanting to train this Darren Sproles because he's non auctional already. Um,. I'm gonna go ahead and train him so there you go as soon as you train the player this is a really bad example because you're not gonna see but training your player makes him unauctionable that's right when you train him he becomes unauctionable and you cannot put him on the auction house now he's already an 81 with 85 speed i'm gonna give him up a little more um yeah but definitely would not recommend training your players uh in order to make a profit thinking that you can use them in certain sets uh that are like elite or whatever I'm not really sure. Uh, let's throw some of these bronze players in. I think an 84 is going to be good. So yeah, I pulled this guy in a um, the live event, which is pretty sick. Uh, 87 speed, I'll take it. Oh, is that sweet? So you can... Oh, so that's... Pff, learn something every day. Uh, I did not know that you could just watch. Uh, so everything is just pretty linear, I guess. Plus 5 speed. So the max on this guy is a 92 speed. Just for a gold player, that's super sick. 
Anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully, you learned something in this video. Maybe you learned something. Probably not. I'm not really sure. If you like this video, you want to see more videos like this, what not to do, go subscribe to this channel. Go like, go comment. I will be doing random giveaways at any given moment. I mean, Gronk TD OG fan, gotta shout him out again. He's been one of my giveaways. I give away PayPal. I gave away PayPal last time. You could be the next winner. I'll, and uh, I have no idea what to say. I'll see you all next video.